there GCSE physicists. Today we are going to be talking about weight. So we've got an astronaut on Earth who's got a mass of 80 kilos. We need to state the equation that links weight, mass and gravitational field strength. So equation sheets out, let's go. We're looking for W for weight is equal to M for mass multiplied by G for gravitational field strength. Now, in this question, they've actually given us gravitational field strength on Earth as 9.8 newtons per kilogram if you're doing AQA, GCSE. However, the exam does not need to give you that number. You are expected to memorize this number, okay? And use it when you need to. Now, we need to next state the weight of the astronaut on the Earth. So the weight is equal to the mass, which is 80 kilos multiplied by 9.8, which is the gravitational field strength on Earth, which gives us an answer of 784 newtons. Right. Finally, the astronaut travels to the moon where the gravitational field strength is 1.6 newtons per kilogram. We need to explain what happens to their mass and to their weight. So the mass of the astronaut is about the amount of matter that they are made up of. OK, it's like the number of atoms in the astronaut. That hasn't changed just because they've gone to the moon. So their mass stays the same. Their weight, on the other hand, though, will decrease because the gravitational field strength is smaller. So if we're timesing their weight of 80 kilos by a smaller number, so their mass of 80 kilos by a smaller number, we're going to get a smaller weight. I hope this video was useful. Don't forget to check out my resources on the My Edspace website for more questions, worked examples, or just for notes. And if you want more content like this, just drop me a follow. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.